we went into the town nearby. The last time that I will be in my childhood room. Hello besties and welcome back to another video. As you can see, I am in a bit of a different location also of minimal makeup on because I am at the beach. Let me just close this window here. So um we are at our usual holiday destination. Um so my mom's half of the family stays here and we have this little beach houses on um the beach. We just come here in December mostly. So I am um, as you can see rather relaxed and spending most of the day in my bikini um, and I thought I don't know how much I'll be able to vlog or show you but I can at least try and show you a little bit of what what we get up to here and this is really such a beautiful part of the Western Cape well I think unofficially it's called Southern Cape I don't know but yeah it's close to George and Mossel Bay. So yeah, complete different setting. We woke up at 5 a.m. this morning and we got here at like 12. And yeah, so it was a quite a drive, but coffee gets me going. <laughs> and this is my room. The houses are very um very primitive. I don't know if that's the right word in English but it's very plain and simple and like nothing special as you can see because it's old houses that they just kind of revamped a little bit and my lips are so red because it's got just a little bit sunburn so this is my room that's all my mess and that is where I will be sleeping and it focuses that is my view it's literally like right there and got myself a little book and a pen when we stopped oh i'm not zoomed in oh. when we stopped at one of the shops on our way here because i thought you know what there's literally no electricity there's only some solar panels on the roof which charges a car battery to charge your phone and like the lights you can see oh where is it there just like small LED lights which works with the solar panels as well so yes no TV no Wi-Fi no nothing so it's usually good to have something with you to just I don't know write your thoughts down it's the 2nd of January today I feel like I'm ready to write down my goals for 2022 and all of those lovely things so always handy to have a little book with you whenever you feel like it's the time to write something down
Monday morning today and I must say I don't mind Mondays when it starts like this and I have this lovely view etc. So yeah, I just wanted to pop in and say hello and yeah, please note I'm not naked. I just have a, stra a strapless bikini top on. Um, I just popped on here because I thought I might just want to show you what I do for like a I don't want to call it a makeup look because honestly it's two products it's not even a thing I just do my usual skincare but then I add an extra layer of sunscreen that's why I look a bit shiny because my regular sun sunscreen my regular sunscreen is um, finished and Switch Beauty doesn't have their sunscreen on their site anymore. I think they like launching a new formula or something soon. So unfortunately I don't have my usual sunscreen so I had to use like this oily version. So I'm just hoping that it doesn't break out my skin but we'll have to see. So I just do my usual skincare but then um, I use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer to just touch up my under eyes so that I look a bit more awake and just like in my t-zones and if I have any blemishes then I'll just pop this over and then literally the only thing that I do is I use the Almay brow styler that I've mentioned in a previous video that I will link down below for you um, just to fluff up my brows a little bit just to give it a bit more definition and that is my look and then I obviously just put my Lanolab lip balm or multi-use balm actually on my lips um, for just some protection against the sun and whatever so that I've also mentioned in a previous video the same one I mentioned the brow styler in but I will link that video below and that is my look for the day because I'm going to be probably on the beach the entire day and I might take a swim or whatever and then I don't want streaks of mascara running down my face so this is the sum total of what I do to my face and I just think I look a bit, little better than just having no makeup on at all um, and that's that so I don't know what I'll be showing you today um, I don't always take my ca camera with me because you know water is not a good mixture with the camera but I yeah I will see what I show you and I hope you enjoy this holiday with me. Hello besties! I hope you can hear me because um, the wind is quite hectic. Once again, not naked, I'm just wearing a bikini. Um, Yes, today is Tuesday and I haven't really spoken to you yet and not really much yesterday either um, but today we went into the town nearby and we had like a little breakfast just me and my family we had a little bit of a breakfast um, and it was quite nice I forgot my camera at home I wanted to take it and then I completely forgot so I'm going to insert some footage here that I filmed on my phone. location and the name for you and you yeah, at the moment I'm just chilling here by the tide pool type of thing um, just working on my tan a little bit because uh, apparently the weather for the next few days might not look too great and I'm making food tonight so I need to soak up the Sun as much as I can before I need to go and prep for that and you yeah, just enjoying a very very chilled week. I had to do some work um, but 
for now it is all that we need to do hi it's me again um, it's a bit later now and as you can see I'm no longer in my bikini I came home took a shower and just put moisturizer on my entire body and oh my word it felt so amazing you know that feeling when you get home off to the beach and you just take this nice long shower and you get back into your clothes and you're like moisturizing your body oh, it's just like the best feeling ever and yeah i'm about to just chill a little bit um there wasn't much time for chilling today because i was outside most of the day on the afternoon after we went to town just because i am working on my summer tan <laughs> So I'm hoping I look a bit more tan than in my previous videos except for my face because I try to not get my face in the sun because wrinkles and I don't want to look 60 when I'm 50. <laughs> in my old room in my parents' house. Um, I'm on my way back to Cape Town now, um, just for the last week of the holidays before I need to start working again. But I thought I would just document this moment because my parents are actually moving house next week and this is the very last time that I will be in my childhood room. And it's a very weird feeling. I'm not a very sentimental person, let me just put that out there, but it's still, it's weird, feels weird. So, goodbye room, I will see you never again. Hmm. Hello everyone, um, as you can see, I am back in my little home. And I am having a glass of wine. <laughs> Sneaky. Ugh, but I mean, it is a Saturday afternoon and it is woo, very, very hot. It's very hot. So I'm currently just chilling. Um, I took a few clips of a coffee shop that we visited in Stellenbosch and it's called Huga Huga. You spell it not the way you say it. I think it's a Swedish word or something, but I will insert the clips that I took with my phone now. <laughs> So, 
and I wanted to say we are just chilling for the rest of the day um, I just got back from a little food shop or well, not really a food shop just like a, a home shop I had to buy like toilet paper and stay soft and you know all those things that actually breaks your bank because it is so expensive and nearly had a heart attack but anyways it's done and usually I don't buy those things a lot because I buy them in bulk so whenever I buy them it's like oh my lord I'm broke but it lasts me a while a long while <laughs> video off um, you should have just seen some random footage before this and we actually went to the old biscuit mall yesterday which was Sunday and it, it was my first time there and I thoroughly enjoyed it like it was such a cool crowd that was there and I don't think I've ever seen a more diverse place <laughs> than there they, you literally got something and someone of every group and whatever and I loved it so um, very cool vibes, um, so definitely check them out if that's something you've been meaning to do. Um, but yes, today is Monday. I've already started the new vlog for this week and I actually just filmed a hair straightener review slash how I style my hair video. And that should be going up on my channel on Friday. So keep an eye out for that. And I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching and it would do me such a favor if you gave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and comment if you want to know anything, tell me anything um, or whatever. I appreciate all of your support as always. I'll see you in the next one. Toodles!